The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier. Our first reading is from the book of the prophet Isaiah. Console my people, console them, says your God. Speak to the heart of Jerusalem and cry to her that her period of service is ended, that her guilt has been atoned for, that from the hand of Yahweh she has received double punishment for all her sins. A voice cries, prepare in the desert a way for Yahweh. Make a straight highway for our God across the wastelands. Let every valley be filled in, every mountain and hill be leveled. Every cliff become a plateau, every escarpment a plain. Then the glory of Yahweh will be revealed and all humanity will see it together. For the mouth of Yahweh has spoken. A voice said, cry aloud, and I said, what shall I cry? All humanity is grass and all its beauty like the wildflowers. The grass withers, the flower fades when the breath of Yahweh blows on them. The grass is surely the people. The grass withers, the flower fades, but the word of our God remains forever. Go up on a high mountain, messenger of Zion. Shout as loud as you can, messenger of Jerusalem. Shout fearlessly, say to the towns of Judah, here is your God, here is Lord Yahweh coming with power. His arm maintains his authority, his reward is with him and his prize precedes him. He's like a shepherd feeding his flock, gathering lambs in his arms, holding them against his breast and leading to their rest the mother use. In our response, from Psalm 96. Sing a new song to Yahweh. Sing to Yahweh all the earth. Sing to Yahweh, bless his name. Proclaim his salvation day after day. Declare his glory among the nations, his marvels to every people. Say among the nations, Yahweh is king. The world is set firm. It cannot be moved. He will judge the nations with justice. Let the heavens rejoice and earth be glad. Let the sea thunder and all it holds. Let the countryside exalt and all that is in it. And all the trees of the forest cry out for joy at Yahweh's approach, for he is coming, coming to judge the earth. He will judge the world with saving justice and the nations with constancy. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. Jesus said, Tell me, suppose a man has a hundred sheep and one of them strays. Will he not leave the ninety-nine on the hillside and go in search of the stray? In truth, I tell you, if he finds it, it gives him more joy than do the ninety-nine that did not stray at all. Similarly, it is never the will of your Father in heaven that one of these little ones should be lost. The Gospel of the Lord.